Grumpy Goblin here, and welcome to what will soon be Grumpy's World. That's right, I'm going to be rolling a brand new world uh, here in the latest snapshot of Minecraft, which is, uh, which is a, what is it, a 14, 14W17A, I believe. Um, we're going to be rolling a new world. I like this new, uh, this new uh, snapshot because it's got, a, got some new blocks. Um, I, I even came across the, a, a new mob, I believe. I was in a cave playing around uh, in this uh, snapshot earlier, and I came across a zombie um, a zombie skeleton. Uh, it was a zombie with no, no bow, and it had its arms in front of it, and it was walking towards me. It was kind of weird and freaky and everything. So um, I'm excited to start this new new world. So um, well, without further ado, let's go ahead and start it, and I'll... Uh, I'll talk about my plans as it generates the world. I'm going to be using this world to to experiment with uh, some of the new command block commands, uh, some of the new command block programming. Ooh, ooh, nice. This is a nice spawn. I like this. Where are we at? We're in plain biomes. Uh, I'm going to be using this world. Let's let the world generate a couple minutes here or a minute here. Um, I'm going to be using this uh, this world to experiment with command blocks to work on some uh, building experimentation, some things that I would like to try building. Um, and uh, just kind of, uh, I, need to, I need to experiment more with command blocks. Um, I haven't done a whole lot with them and I need, I'm going to need to learn some command block programming uh, for some of the projects that I've got uh, on my radar, uh, which I'll be talking about over the next uh, the next few weeks and days and months and uh, and whatnot. Um, but in this world, uh, it's just going to be... Um, oh, look at that. What a great spawn. What a great spawn. Right right by a desert temple. Um, I'm, I am I'm very, very happy. Very, very happy with this spawn indeed. Oh. And uh, we've got the zombies. I think we might have a zombie spawner somewhere around here too. Uh, anyway... Very happy with this spawn. So let me go ahead. Let's get some tools going here. Uh, let's make it with this beautiful acacia wood. Ding. All right. Crafting table. Yes, I see you eating there. All right, give me a pick. Uh, give me a shovel or an axe. And uh, give me a couple more sticks. And give me a shovel. Um, might as well do a sword, since there's some animals standing around. Let's go ahead and get some food. Um, why did I kill the sheep? That's not food. Oh well, I need the wool, and I don't have any iron yet, uh, so I can't can't make a sh can't make any shears yet. So, ah, ha -ha! death from above, sheep. Um, so anyway, yeah, I'm just gonna be experimenting around in this world. Uh, learning command block programming and uh, teaching you what I learn as I learn it. So um, hopefully I learn some good stuff, or hopefully I catch on well enough to teach it. Uh, I am I am a uh, computer programmer and a web developer. Um, I work uh, in the tech industry. I have uh, wrote iPhone apps. I've written Android apps. Um, so I'm fairly confident that I will be able to pick up um, command, block pro command block programming without without too much of a hassle. Um, at least I hope so. Um, let's see here. Let's Where'd those pigs go? I thought we spawned right by some pigs. Did they despawn already? Cause I'm not seeing them. I'm not seeing those. I thought there were some pigs. I might be totally imagining it. Maybe I wanted to see some pigs. Oh, and there's a village over there. There's a... Okay, I got a village over there, and I've got a desert temple over here. This... I don't, I don't think I could have planned for a better spawn, and that was awesome. I mean, this is just great. Um, I do not want to lose the locations of these. All right, so there's the desert temple. I could go over to the... Let's go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and make some more wood here. Do you see any exposed stone? I don't. Let's get some more wood. There's some chickens. Let's let's get some chickens. Oh, there's a bunch of chickens. 
that'll be a nice little start. That'll be a nice little start. Let's get some chickens. So while I'm uh, while I'm coming over here to slaughter these chickens, um, I wanted to talk about the public uh, server that I'm going to be opening up here within the next week. I think it's called Maginor, and it is pretty much an open, uh, loosely loosely a loose RPG uh, based uh, server. Um, what a great location. Uh, there's like levels and, and things like that and jobs and things that you can have. But it's pretty much a free build. It's going to be a totally uh, free build server. Um, <laughs> um, I don't have enough blocks to climb down there yet. So let's just hold off on that. Um, let's get some sand. We'll just pillar down to it. Um, so yeah, the server is going to be called um, Maginor, and uh, I've got the spawn area built. Uh, I've got most of the plugins in and uh, and configured, uh, and uh, I'm just kind of kind of waiting to uh, put some finishing touches on the some of the. Uh, Some of the plugins, uh, in order to make the uh, make it ready for for public use. Uh, there's going to be there's towns you can come in and create your own town, all kinds of cool stuff. So that's going to be opening up in the next couple weeks. Um, I'm working on a uh, on a uh, trailer video to kind of uh, talk about and show off the server. Uh, there's absolutely nothing on the server except the spawn area. I mean, I literally... Oh, this is such a great, a great uh, first start. Got some bones. Let's go ahead and get some chests. Uh, it's going it, to... It, basically, the server is just wide open. Uh, it's going to be open to the public. Uh, there's world protection and locking chests, and uh, you can actually claim plots of land, and you can go together with your friends and actually form towns. And if enough towns, uh, you know, form together, then you can form nations. Uh, it's just, it's going to be fun. It's just going to be a nice little, uh, fun, creative world where people can just, you know, get together, build and uh, do cool stuff. So let's head over to that village. Oh dear. Yeah, that's where I cut in, so it's over this way, I believe. Yeah, because here's where I here's where I came in. Yeah, let's head over to the village. We'll get some uh we'll get a bed built and then we'll uh raid the village for some food. Um I actually got some dime or some uh emeralds uh from the from the temple there, so I uh, might be able to trade for some early game stuff. Um, I just hope I don't starve before I find the village and get to it. Down to three food. It was over this way. I can't run anymore. That really stinks. Where was that village? Come on, there's some more chickens clucking. I have to, I'll scarf down some raw chicken. There's a zombie. I heard some I heard some eggs. I heard an egg pop out of someone one of these. There it is down there. Let's go ahead and grab that egg for later. I saw a flaming zombie. He looks like he died. Um there's that village over there to my left. Alrighty. So I'm gonna get to the village. Uh we're gonna get over there. And kind of get moved in. I think I might uh, make make it in my temporary starter base so that I can uh, build up my stuff. There might be a furnace. If there's a blacksmith over there, there's going to be a furnace that I can use. Uh, oh, there's some exposed coal. Nice. Let's go ahead and grab some while we're here. 
think I got enough time to get some coal and get over there before I die of starvation. Or at least start taking damage. Um, so yeah, so I got Maginor open up. That's going to be opening up in the next couple weeks. And then I've got a project on the horizon that is just now in the planning stages that is going to blow your mind. Um, I'm calling it a prison server, uh, a, prison, a prison server, but not a prison server. At least it's not going to be any type of prison server that you have ever seen and or imagined. Um, I have searched far and, and, and low, far and high, high and low, far and near, all over the internet. I have been trying to find uh, anything even remotely similar to this, and I haven't been able to uh, in this implementation. So, because I because I wanted to make sure that if I called it unique, it actually was unique. Because there's so many things out there that you know they say, oh, it's unique, and there's already six or seven uh, things of that of that kind already out there. Um, but I wanted this to be truly unique, uh, truly one of a kind, and uh, I, I believe that it is. It's an idea I came up with uh, about three weeks ago, and I've been uh, developing it and coming up with ideas for it, and I'm talking to some uh, developers. And talking to some uh, bucket programming. Night is coming. I need to get inside. Hopefully one of these uh, houses will have a bed. That one has a crafting table. Nothing. Alright, no bed. Alright, we've got a uh, we've got a blacksmith. Sweet. This is going to be awesome. Uh, let's go ahead and throw coal and chicken in. And uh, you know what, this looks like a good place to stop, build a bed, and rest. Uh, so let's go ahead and throw that down. Do -do -do -do. Do -do -do -do. There's my bed. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and sleep. And I'll be right back. And I am back. Good morning. Alright. Uh, let's go ahead and leave the bed there, and that'll be a nice spawn point, uh, spawning point. Um, let's see here. Is there any of them ready? Yes. So yeah, it's a unique, um, it's a unique idea for a game um, that involves, you know, a multiplayer game. Um, it's going to be pretty cool. Like I said, it's a prison. It's a prison server, but not like any kind of prison server that you've ever played before. It's going to be awesome. Uh, it, I am just so excited. Oh, and we got some horses, and I've got some horse armor. i got some diamond horse armor, and there's some horses. Yes. This is so awesome. i got some diamond armor. Um, hello, horsies. <laughs> yes. One of you will be wearing this armor soon. Very, very soon. Um, all right, so the farmer is busy working in his field. Let's check out this. Whoa. <laughs> Dude, you, you really need to, to mow your living room. <laughs> um, yeah, standard village. Uh, this, is a, this, was, this has been a great spawn point. Uh, that temple gave me a bunch of stuff. And um, ooh, look at this nice big house. It's nice. Like I said, I might set up camp here for a little bit till I get built up, till I can go out. Um, got some armor. Got some boots. Um, all right, where is the? Here we go. Gonna get my chicken. Don't have anything to smelt, do I? Oh, I had a saddle. I have a saddle. What? Mm. Um, I don't have a whole lot of experience with horses. Do you just saddle them and that's it? Or I think you saddle them and you have to ride them. I like these black ones with the white dots. I think that looks neat. Walking all over the food. Uh, is there one out in the field? How do you how do you do this? I do not know anything about horses. Okay. Nope. Are you supposed to feed them something first? All right. Give me, give me a second here. I'm gonna pause this here real quick. I'm gonna look up some information on horses. Like I said, I am clueless. All right. I'll be right back. Thanks. Okay. So apparently, I'm an idiot, and these saddles are for pigs. 
Um, and to tame a horse, you right click and you get on it. And eventually, they let you stay on. Is that true? I'm not really in control here. Yep, kick me off. All right. That's all right. You're supposed to pet it or something. Pet it. Pet it. Oh, no, no, get up. No, I do. Oh, my gosh. You stupid cactus. <laughs> oh, my gosh. That was that was traumatic. Uh, he, he did hearts, and then he walked right into that... Uh, Right into that cactus. That was really traumatic. I am so sorry. Oh, look, and he's, he's showing damaged. How do you heal up your horse? I don't know how to do that. Uh, let's see here. Let me hop off of him. Put some armor on him. Oh. Is this for real? No. Oh, my goodness. Okay, this is the coolest thing ever. Oh, my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh. <laughs> okay, I am very happy with this spawn. Think about this spawn, okay? I have never in my years of Minecraft had a spawn as good as this one. Uh, now the only thing I understand is that he'll, he has a tendency to just kind of wander off. So, uh, let's go put him in that big house. I've got to find a uh, a rope or a lead or whatever it's called. I found that big house around here. Can I actually get him into a house? Here it is. Here was that big. Can I? Can you lead a horse into a building? I guess you could if there was enough room. Yeah. See, look at him. He's just wandering around. Like, doo -doo -doo. I'm out of here. Thanks for riding me. I appreciate it. Let's make a big enough space for him to get in. Okay, come back here. Come back here. I gotta get a name tag. I gotta name you. You are my horse. You are my my diamond horse. Can you go inside? Oh, come on. You can't get through that hole? Alright, well then let's make it larger. I think it's me who's causing the problem. Come back. Come back. Come back. There we go. I gotta be thinking of a name for you. Can, okay, does it have to be too wide then or something? <sighs> anyway, like I was saying, I'm very happy with this, with this spawn, because this, I've never, there we go, left shift, now let's close him in here, alright, I will be back, I need to find the rest of the stuff I need to take care of you properly, is that what? Oh, that's just, that's just awesome. I'm just, I'm so, did I mention I'm happy? And if I can, how can I see his inventory? Is that with a bare hand? You click on him, right click on him with a bare hand. I don't know. I, like I said, I don't know enough about horses. I don't know enough. I don't know. I don't know anything. I don't know. That's the first horse I've ever tamed. Um, so anyway, we're at 20 minutes. I uh, just want to thank you for watching. Uh, keep an eye out on the on the uh, channel here for more information about those upcoming projects. And I'm going to be putting up the IP address for the public Maginor uh, survival adventure type server. It's going to be open to everybody, to you and to all your friends. Um, so just come on and build and, and meet people. And, uh, anyway, say, uh, say goodbye, horsey. I got to think of a name for you. All right. Um, that's pretty cool. I think that's pretty cool. All right, well, thank you very much for watching. Take care and see you next time. Bye, 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 bye.